Welcome back to Gin Reviews from South Florida. Tonight, I'm so excited. I will be reviewing Beefeater 47. Right here, right now. Let's dive into this. King Joe. Beefeater 47 coming in at 47%. We are made in London, England. It's classic London dry grain is the base. The botanicals, of course, are almond, angelica, coriander, juniper, of course, lemon, licorice, orange, and orris root. Some of you out there may be uh, questioning this right now, saying, Joe, you've already done bee feeder. How and why are you doing it again? Well, it's true I have done Bee Feeder in the past, but the bottle that I had to review was their newest one, where they cut the alcohol down to 44%. Now, I went out on one of my little gin picks today, and I found two 47s. <laughs> of course, I had to buy them both. Wow, now that just brings me back. It's definitely, you can smell it's different, even on the smell, the aroma from the 44. It's way better. It's nice, it's stronger. It has more of the juniper pronounce that's just dry, you know? It has that really robust juniper, but it, you can tell it's a very dry, dry spirit. Oh, I see wheat legging. So wheat, yes, of course. A little bit. Why? Why did you have to lower your proof? Why? This is beautiful. This is the way I remember it. This is the bee feeder here in my hand. Two ounces of our 47. Yeah. There it is. <laughs> uh, let me add my citrus. It's it's lacking without the citrus. The citrus is what makes this the best cocktail, I think. Uh, so lime, lemon, and some uh, white grapefruit. Salute, eh? Cheers. Don't get me wrong, I still love Bee Feeder, even if it's at 44%, but they made a horrible decision because this is truly the way it's supposed to be. The other way with the 44% tastes more like Bee Feeder Light, and I think that's what I'll be calling it from now on. So like I said, if you can find a bottle of 47% out there in the world, pick it up. Hold on to it, cherish it. It's a relic. It's something that should be, but for God knows what reason, it's not. So, uh, from me to you to you to me to everyone here in the middle of the states from sea to shining sea, thanks so much. Coming on back, have another cocktail and a little history lesson, a little adventure with me, the Gin Joe, doing new gin reviews every Tuesday and Friday at 5 p.m. Eastern Time. I'll be throwing a new gin review out there. Your questions and your comments are always welcomed, and hit the subscribe button for me if you if you wouldn't mind. I'd love to gain some more subscribers into this world of gin and YouTube. <laughs> Until the next one, you bastards. Like, comment, and subscribe, and every Tuesday and Friday at 5 p.m. will be a new gin review from the Gin Joe. Cheers.